Welcome to my presentation. Here I'm presenting the unsupervised intradomain adaptation for semantic segmentation through self-supervision. This work is done by Fei Pan, Ying Xing, Francois Ramu, Sak Li, and In So Kwan. This work is supported by Bosch. Semantic segmentation aims at assigning each pixel in the image to a semantic class. Recently, convolutional neural network-based segmentation models have achieved remarkable progresses. To train such a network requires a large amount of data. However, annotations for semantic segmentation are difficult to be collected since they're expensive, labor-intensive, and time-consuming. More recently, photorealistic datasets such as GTA 5 rented from simulators with precise annotations have been utilized to train segmentation networks. However, the model trained from synthetic data are hardly transferable to real data due to the cross-domain gap. Existing unsupervised adaptation approaches have been proposed to align the gap between the source and target domain. These approaches either work on the feature level or image level to learn the domain invariant features. However, existing approaches have only considered the distribution gap between the source and target domain, which is called inter-domain gap here. We found that there is a large distribution gap among the target data itself, which is called inter-domain gap here. In this work, we propose two-step domain adaptation approach to minimize the inter-domain gap and the inter-domain gap altogether. Our philosophy is shown here. We first conduct the inter-domain adaptation. From this adaptation, we separate the target domain into an easy and hard split using the entropy-based ranking function. In the next step, we utilize the pseudo labels from the easy images and adopt an intra-domain adaptation to align the domain gap among the target data. This is the framework of the proposed model, which consists of three parts, namely an inter-domain adaptation, an entropy-based ranking system, and an intra-domain adaptation. The first step is inter-domain adaptation, which is based on common unsupervised domain adaptation approaches. In this work, we utilize the entropy of predictions from segmentation outputs to align the domain gap. The inter-domain adaptation consists of a generator and discriminator. The generator is to generate the entropy map for the input image. And the discriminator is to predict the domain label for the entropy map, while the generator is to fold the discriminator. The second step is the entropy-based ranking system. Given an unlabeled target image, the prediction map and the entropy map are generated by the trained inter-domain generator. To separate target domain into an easy and hard split, we take advantage of the entropy map and propose a ranking system for all the target images. On this basis, we introduce the hyperparameter lambda as a ratio for the target domain separation. The third step is the intra-domain adaptation, which consists of an intra-domain generator and a discriminator. To align the intra-domain gap, we propose to utilize easy split predictions from the inter-domain generator as pseudo-labels. And we train the generator and discriminator in the same way as in the inter-domain adaptation part. We conducted the adaptation experiment from the GTA 5 to Cityscape datasets. And here are some qualitative results on the Cityscape validation images, which shows that our model utilizing both the inter-domain and inter-domain adaptation outperforms the model only using inter-domain adaptation. We also provide the visualization of samples from the easy and hard split with their segmentation predictions based on the proposed ranking function. The qualitative results of three benchmark datasets highlight the effectiveness of our model against existing state-of-the-art approaches. Further experiment on digit datasets shows that our model can also be extended to digit classification task. In conclusion, we present a self-supervised adaptation technique to minimize the inter-domain and intra-domain gap. Our model can be combined with existing domain adaptation approaches. For the future work, we will extend our model to the video segmentation task. Thank you for listening to my presentation and welcome to access our code on GitHub.